What's up guys? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. Over here working on the race car a little bit. I was going to take a little bit of a break and I wanted to talk to you guys about something. One of the most common questions I get asked is when am I going to street race? When am I going to attend one of these big pre-games or post-games or you know some of the pad stuff? When am I going to go on the street and prove that I can hang? I used to street race all the time. It's not possible for me to do it now. It's just not a good idea. There's a few things, but my biggest thing is my normal career. YouTube is my part-time side hustle. I'm just trying to record and show you guys what I'm doing. My full-time job requires me to have a driver's license. And there's been a lot of YouTubers, not necessarily in the drag racing world, but there's a lot of YouTubers that are starting to get busted. The police, they're starting to crack down after the fact. People are posting videos on YouTube of them doing hot rod and doing 160 miles an hour on the interstate. You're breaking the law and you're recording yourself doing it and then posting it for everybody to see for eternity or until you delete the video. Actually, it may still be out there even after you delete the video. So street racing has a lot of possible consequences. We hadn't seen a lot of it happening in the drag racing world. Hopefully it doesn't. You know, hopefully those, those channels that street race all the time and the content creators that go out there and record it, hopefully they're still able to do it. I love watching it. But it's just too risky for me. My full-time job requires me to have a driver's license. And if something was to happen and the cops were to come after me and I was to lose my license, then I lose my 23-year career that I've got. So I'm almost to retirement. There's just no way I'm going to chance risking that. The other thing, I like being able to do this stuff. I enjoy racing. I enjoy being free. Uh, a lot of these street races, man, they're, they're dangerous. You know, everybody signs up for it. But the reality is, is if one of these racers, if you've got people lined up down the road and, you know, they're 100 foot, 200 foot, 300 foot out, finish line, whatever. If I lose control of my car and I kill somebody, I'm going to jail and I, I'm not going to do good in jail. So I don't want to be there. So if it happens at the drag strip, it's a controlled environment. You're not breaking the law. The odds, I guess, potentially you could still go to jail, but the, the odds of it not happening or more in my favor when we got some guardrails, when we got some uh, promoters that are keeping people back off the starting line. I mean, it gets kind of sketchy sometimes, even at the back of the track events. There's a lot of people close to the cars, but it's still not the street. Uh, you know, so, you know, Big Chief said a long time ago, be street, if you ain't street, be ain't. Uh, I ain't, uh, just not gonna happen for me guys. Street racing, just can't do it. I enjoy watching it uh, on film. I usually don't even go attend. I've attended a few, but it's, man, it's just, it's so dangerous. Uh, so I, I just, I just can't do it. But I just wanted to put that out there and just say it, I ain't street. Uh, now, if you shut down the street, you get a permit, you get something where the, you know, the, the we can race there legally, uh, I'm down. I think I can make this car to go down any surface. Uh, well, that that's not necessarily true. I suck at it. I still can't win. But the street racing just ain't for me. I can't do it. Uh, I love no prep. That is what I'm digging, what I'm having the most fun doing right now. Prep racing is a whole different ball game. No prep, I think, is going to be really big this year, especially as glue prices skyrocket. So let's go drag racing. I'm going to be at the top end of the track. We'll be doing some front side stuff, no prep. But going on the street, you ain't going to see my car out there. My car will never be on the street. All right, guys, comment, like, and subscribe. We'll see y'all soon. Later.